Here's a cheap guy. I haven't made a cheap guy video for a long time. But I'm going to show you how to make um, soft cat food from dry cat food. Remember the old gravy train commercials where they just add water to the, the dog's food? This is a little bit different. Similar, but a little bit different. Just exactly the same, but only different. But uh, there's a cheap guy video. Enjoy if you have cats. Yeah, I usually use the cheaper brand, you know, Pet Pride or Nine Lives or something like that. You know, it's a hard cat food, and I'm going to turn it into soft cat food. I've been doing this for years. I don't know if people, other people do it or not. But, uh, you know, there's liquid in this. You can hear that liquid. This right here is, what is this? Chicken breast, chunk chicken. Or you can use, hear that liquid? Chili. Sometimes you can open that up and you see a lot of grease and different things like that at the top. Same with pork and beans. You get a lot of liquid and stuff. But today what I'm going to do is I'm going to use tuna fish. You know, you can use chunk ham. Whoop, I'm making a mess. Dang, dang it. But you just uh, pour that around. You can get quite a bit. You know, you can use chunk ham or whatever. Even bacon grease, you know. I use bacon grease or hamburger grease or whatever. Uh, people say, don't do that to your animals. Don't do it to your animals. But if you give, uh, put bacon grease or hamburger grease on this hard cat food, man, cats will fight each other over it. But this is how to make soft cat food out of hard cat food. You know, because that soft stuff costs a fortune. And uh, you just let that set overnight, and I'll show you what it looks like tomorrow. And uh, we'll see what the cats think. They love it. Honestly, they do. You can use anything. You know, even, um, let's say, for instance, how about SpaghettiOs or something like that. You know, it's got that sauce and stuff on it. You just put that over there. Dogs and cats are scavengers, so it's not going to hurt them. A lot of bacon grease would probably be bad for them, but, uh, you know, once a month or so. It's okay. Same with hamburger grease. But this is the way to make soft cat food out of hard cat food. It's a lot cheaper. So this is what it looks like. This is later on in the day. Okay, let me see. Huh? The cats want me to pet him or whatever. Pet her. Let me get this out. Get that out. Put it with one hand. If you can see how soft that is. Whoop. There's the other cat. Yeah, you got a bunch of gray ones. See if uh, if it was hard, you could hear them crunching, you know. So that's uh, that's how you make soft cat food. There's no crunching sound at all. Uh, still got some in there. I gotta shut this camera off and dig that out. <laughs> that's how you make uh, soft cat food out of hard cat food. Enjoy.